Welcome to the... Evening all. Peace be with you, my child. Are you a real vicar? Actually both. So, do you believe in God? Oh, definitely. He, he is real. I... I read it in a book, yes. Okay. So theory attributes to outer dimensions pushing in on themselves over and above the constricted heaven and earth. What ru- mm, You're just yanking my chain now. <laughs> Damn right. Oh no, 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 you don't get a case. These belong to someone very special.
Oh no, not for the likes of you. Uncle Frankenstein. You know, it's quite hurtful. I'm so readily recognized in this genetic mutation. I received your distress call. I knew it was you. All the same. I'm a raven here. A reaction would be nice. You said we got a submission. Yes, yes, yes. But you've still got time for a... Why, Uncle Frankenstein? Surely it can't be you! Before we set off and blast the bad guys. He's okay, Uncle. Oh. Woeful, but better. Yeah, do we tool up and cruise for us own? Patience, boy. You want to know why I sent for you, don't you? I'm telling you anyway, just a few hours ago I was conducting a top secret experiment. You were scientists, Hank. It ain't unusual. All the same, this was a real humdinger. That actually is unusual. My lifetime's work. At last the time is nigh. Gore, gore my trusty, if disconcertingly warty assistant. Yes. Oh, master. You may prepare the ghoul cube. Ghoul cube? It's a cube that contains ghouls, or will do. Evidently. See you catch the ghouls in the cube, so as outside the cube there is no ghouls, and we enjoy a ghoul-free society with ghouls strictly cube-bound, confined to their cube and feeling to wander beyond all cuboid parameters. You dislike ghouls? There is nothing but trouble. Now, in the name of science, we shall ensnare evil in its multifarious forms, thus rendering it useless against the world. Then things started to go wrong. You're not used to that yet. He who dares to enter my domain shall suffer the wrath of my invincible cosmic power. Word for word, exactly what I didn't want him to say. You, imbecile fool, toying with forces darkening galaxies, Beyond your comprehension, you shall writhe at my feet. Squirm and tremble for my amusement, for drawing me into this. I nearly 
sold him the deeds to the castle. Something a bit more manageable, I think. I couldn't stand anymore. I grabbed the goo cube and made a try for it. Seize him! Seize him! That cube may be important. So, so that's the problem. If your world is well, I need you to reverse the flow of the dimension gate and send Big D back to his own evil domain. On the case. A gibbet with some poor soul in it. What's a half dead guy like you do? <sighs> do you read a lot of Oscar Wilde? <sighs> it may hurt you to know this. 